Google just released their new VEO 3.1 video model, and today I'm going to show you how to get VEO 3.1 for free. I will walk you step by step through the exact method I used. To grab free access, start by searching for Flow Google Free Credits. Click the first link that appears, and you will land on a page that looks like the one I'm showing you now. Hit the Create with Flow button, and a new page will open. Sign in with your Google account, and once you do, open your account menu and you should see 100 free AI credits ready to use with VEO 3.1. 100 credits will let you make about 5 videos, which is very limited, but don't worry. In this video, I will also reveal how to extend that access and score an entire year of VEO 3.1 credits for free. So stay with me and let's get started. We're going to start right from the computer screen so you can follow along without missing a step. The very first thing you need to do is open up Google and type into the search bar, Google Student One Year Offer. Once you press enter, a series of search results will appear. Among those results, focus your attention on the very first link. You'll notice that it carries the title Free Pro One Year. That's the exact link you want to click on because it will take you directly to the official Google page for this offer. Now that you've landed on the correct page, take a moment to look around and you'll see a prominent button labeled Get Offer. Go ahead and click on it. The moment you do, the site will refresh and bring up a new page. This is where things start to get interesting. You'll immediately be asked to verify your eligibility for the offer. Once you select the verification option, a digital form will appear on your screen. This form will require you to provide some of your personal details in order to confirm that you qualify for the one-year access. When the form loads, you'll immediately notice a section displaying a list of countries that are eligible for the Google Pro one-year access. Take your time and carefully scroll through this list to see if your country is included. If you find your country there, great, go ahead and select it. However, if your country is missing from that list, don't worry there's a simple workaround. To successfully unlock the offer, you'll need to make sure your VPN is turned on and connected to one of the countries that are officially supported. Now, while free VPNs might sometimes get the job done, they often fail or become inconsistent when you need them the most. That's why I always recommend going with a trusted paid VPN. In fact, I personally use NordVPN because of its reliability and speed. For your convenience, I've placed a special discounted link in the description below. Through that link, you'll be able to grab an incredible 74% discount, plus an additional three months of premium access completely free. That way, you'll not only unlock the student offer, but also secure a solid VPN tool you can count on for future needs. For this demonstration, I'm going to choose Nigeria as my selected country. Once you've picked your country, the form will prompt you to select a school name from a drop-down list. This part is very important, so pay close attention. Make sure that the school you choose is not a private university. Selecting a private school can often cause the verification process to fail, and your application might not go through. To keep it simple, always stick with public universities. For example, in my case, I selected University of Nigeria Nsukka, which fits perfectly within the requirements. After that, you can proceed with filling out the rest of the form. Begin by entering your full legal name, then move on to your date of birth. When you reach the email section, there's no need to create a new account just for this. Simply use your existing Gmail address and it will work seamlessly with the process. Everything from here on is straightforward, and as long as you follow these steps carefully, you'll be set to claim your one-year Google Pro access without any problems. Take your time here and double-check every single detail you enter. Make sure your full name, date of birth, and email address all match perfectly with the information tied to your Gmail account. Accuracy at this stage is extremely important because even the smallest mismatch could create problems during the verification process. Once you've carefully filled everything in, you'll be ready to move forward to the next critical step. At this point, we've arrived at the verification stage, and this is where you'll need to provide a student ID to confirm your eligibility. On my screen, you can see that I already have a ready-made template prepared for this purpose. Don't worry if you don't have one yet. I've made it very easy for you. 
I'll be sharing the student ID template on my Telegram channel, and you can edit it completely free using Canva. To get it, just click the link in the pinned comments, and it will take you directly to the editable file. Once you open the template, all you need to do is customize it with your details. Replace the placeholder name, date of birth, use a random phone number with your selected country's code with the exact same information you entered earlier in the form. For this demonstration, I'll be using a random Nigerian phone number to complete mine. After you've updated those fields, simply download the finished ID card to your computer. Make sure your browser permissions allow downloads, and if your browser asks you to confirm the download more than once, just approve it each time. Once your card is saved successfully, head back to the Google form and click on Verify Student Status. The system will take a few seconds to process your request. Now, in some cases, you might not see the usual verification window. Instead, you could be redirected to a page asking you to sign in with an official school account. Don't panic if that happens. It's a common alternative screen. The simple fix is to close that tab immediately and return to the main form. There, you'll see the option to upload your student ID card manually. Select the ID card you just created, upload it, and then hit Submit. After submitting, a short timer will appear on your screen. Just wait patiently, and within a few moments, you should receive a confirmation message showing that your verification has been approved. Once you see that approval, click the Get Google AI Pro button. When the page refreshes, click on Get Student Offer one more time and at that point, you'll have officially unlocked your one-year free access to Google AI Pro. Now, just like in many other tutorials you may have seen on YouTube, this next step involves adding a payment card. This is something I often get asked about, so let's clear up the confusion right away. You don't need a special card, and you don't need money loaded on it. Any valid Visa or MasterCard will work. For this demonstration, I personally used a Nigerian MasterCard with a zero balance, and it worked without any issues. You can also take advantage of a free virtual card. A good option is the one available through Bybit Exchange, which I'm sharing here as a little bonus tip for you. It's simple, fast, and free. Once you have your card, go ahead and enter the details into the required fields. On my screen, you can see that I've already filled in my information, and as soon as I submitted it, the subscription was instantly confirmed. If you ever want to repeat this process on a different account, you can follow these same steps again without any problem. With the payment card step complete, let's move over to Gemini to verify that the Pro Access is active. And there it is. Right next to the account icon, you'll now see the colorful circle with the word Pro. That's your confirmation that the upgrade has gone through successfully and that your 12-month student offer is officially unlocked. To double check, let's go back to Google Flow. I'll refresh the page and as you can see on the dashboard, the account now comes with 1,000 credits ready to use. Everything is active, smooth, and fully functional. Remember to cancel your subscription so as not to be charged next year. And with that, we've completed the entire process. You now know exactly how to unlock one full year of free VEO 3.1 access from anywhere in the world and upgrade your account to Pro. If you followed along carefully, your account should now be ready to create unlimited videos without restriction. Let's test it out for this process. <laughs> That's it for today. If this tutorial has been helpful to you, don't forget to hit the like button. It really supports the channel and motivates me to make more step-by-step -step tutorials like this one. Also, make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss future updates, creative hacks, or in-depth guides. Finally, I'd love to hear from you. Drop a comment below and let me know which part of the process you'd like me to cover in more detail next, or even share the very first video you've created using VEO 3.1.